Oh, well splendid. We're here today at Rubber Cow to learn how to cut rubber. And I have my friend here, Miguel. He's gonna show us how to do it. And there we have it. So we're gonna learn safety tips, cutting tips, and any other type of tips that you really need to learn how to cut rubber anytime you wanna cut it. Safety first, that's always the first thing in mind is safety. Gloves, these are gonna help you prevent cutting your hands. Next step, a measuring tape. You don't know how long you need to cut the rubber without measuring it. The next step that we need is a straight edge guide. The reason being, who wants crooked cuts? Not me, I want straight cuts. Miguel? The last thing about cutting rubber is that rubber naturally has a very high coefficient of friction. Basically what that means is slip resistance. By dipping your sharp utility knife in a cup of soapy water, all it's going to do is lubricate the rubber and help you cut it easier. Well splendid! We've learned the tools, we've seen the techniques, Next thing we got to do is cut the rubber. Let's go over and see what Miguel's up to. Hey Miguel. Hey Brando. Nice to see you. One other thing to keep in mind when cutting rubber is that you want to make sure that your subsurface is something you don't care if it gets scratched up. Another thing to keep in mind, the straight edge guide must run the width of the roll and all the way. You don't want to be using a 12 inch ruler because that'll make crooked cuts and you know what we think about crooked cuts. Alrighty Miguel, lube up that knife and let's cut this rubber. So you may have to score it once before you can get all the way through it. But the key is getting a nice clean score. A nice clean score means a nice clean cut. Alrighty. Let's take a look. A nice clean cut. And that's how you cut rubber at Rubber Cow.